Evening all, and welcome back to Factorio. I am joined as ever by Nerdy Old Gamer. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. And you're building thing. Yes, I am getting pipes going. I just finishing off doing. Whatever this is called. Uh, uh, wall drop. Oh, I was putting in the fuel. That's what I was doing. I remember why I was putting another station. <laughs> I'm sure there was a reason. I'm sure there's a reason I'm putting a station up here. Oh, yeah, fuel. It's a good reason. Who would have thought it? And I'm going to remove all the. Horrible. Damn. Power poles doing the thing they're supposed to do and put them down by. <coughs> Blueprint. There we go. Okay. Uh, I also need to ground. Let's just make. Uh, I, it's this is an underground belt. Okay. This is going to be fuel the top. There we go. We need some inserts. And there we go. And a little bit of power. Okay, so we're making pipes. Hurrah! Uh, and I kind of actually let's deconstruct that. There, and then we need to split out. Oh, oh, that's a new feature. What's that? If you drag a belt across a rail or across anything, just drag it from one side to the other, it will automatically put in underground belt. Oh, cool. That is nice. Yep. Yep. Does catch right if you're putting it down under around trees, however. It puts underground belts under the trees. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so. Yeah. All right, so that's pipes going. We might need more. I think we do need more. Power, 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 power. Go on, my pretties. Place all of the belt, uh, rail. <coughs> it's tough to work for you when you tell them to put down one thing and it's not actually what you want them to put down. Large belt. Large belts that carry huge items called trains. Okay, yeah, fair enough. <laughs> right, so over here. Yeah, if I was programming these drones, I would program them to know that when I say something, they'd be like, are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Actually, no, I wouldn't, because that winds me up in window, so no. It would just be, go put the belts down, and then when they put them down, I'd be like, why did I say put belts down? That's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we don't need as many of these. 
because yeah, they're yeah, not yeah. used in anything science or anything. So actually, let's. Deconstruct down there. Get out. Okay, I'll train up first. No. Uh, get. You know what? We don't need half of this. And we'll do filter inserters. And you filter uh, pipe and other chest. You filter. Uh, we need filter inserters down here. Uh, filter inserter. There. And you be set to pipe to ground. So if we just split off here. In the way there. there. Try to clean my train up a little bit. Okay, and let's limit it to. I don't know why I've got so many inserts. That. Right. And you get limited to that. Do don't think we need more than this. So that maybe just take in some power. Radar generator, but radar the other. And I actually think I should probably explore a little bit because I'm building right near an area that's black. Okay. So let's go and have a look. See. That sounds dangerous. Yeah, I'm gonna have a quick mosey over at all the dead trees. Okay. Oh, damn it. I completely forgot. Uh... Note yourself, bring tank next time you want to explore. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a plan. Just, just so I can drive through the trees and, uh, you know, make life a bit easier. Yeah. Okay, so there's water over here. There's a fighter base. A bit of copper down the bottom of my tool. We could do with some more iron, really, couldn't we? Yes, we could. Mm. 
another uh, oil pack. And we have the other oil patch up at uh, up in the north. Yeah, we've got a few around us that I'm not to put into yet. Is there? Yep. Another oil pack. Yeah. That's not possible. It's a shame the amount of the stuff on the minimap doesn't tell you how to there. Yeah. Seven point two million coal, two thousand oil, two thousand two hundred oil. Not many resources, only two biobases, not too bad. Okay. Like pollution get yeah, pollution is not even at all awesome. There was some copper, some coal, and some wheel. So Okay. Right, so if we take thing I do need to do is make sure this is hooked up. Alright, so we have fuel coming. Steel. So we have a walls um station mm -hmm. but I don't have any trade. Okay. Because I can't put the train on. So. Uh, let's tell you to come over here real quick. Uh, it'll get here. It'll get here eventually. And you'll stay here for 120 seconds. Okay. Oh, looks like we have a train jam. Is that me blocking the line? Yes, it. Where do we have a train jam? Uh, my because my train is five carriages long. Ah. Uh, being chunky and uh, blocking the rails. <laughs> there we go. And there you are. And let's see. Uh, let's take you off automatic for a second. I kind of realized that putting those, uh, those ten, okay. signals. So we will do one thing. Two, three, four, five. And exactly. this one will just be right. that. Yeah, because that's clear. Uh, I made a mistake. And then we'll do one. Two. Okay. So it has 
uh, let's just see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine things at it. That's fine. All right, and then we'll add a station called. Uh, actually, we need to rename that station. It's going to be called a mall type pickup. And then we can add that station to you. And set you on to automatic. And we can remove that temporary one. Okay. This does. This is basically too right. Very good. We're making all this. And there's the fuel train. Yay. And what's next? Uh, it was engine units that I wanted to make. Where can I do that? That is not completely dangerous. I think when dealing with uh, anything that explodes, it doesn't matter where you put it, it's going to be dangerous. That's true. General way of things. And engines explode. They explode a lot. They do. They're, they're controlled explosions. Sometimes. <laughs> most most of the time they're, they're controlled explosions. Yeah, that's, that's true. The is that they're supposed to be controlled explosions. Yeah. Um, it's when they don't get controlled is when they have problems. That's that's. Yeah. Okay, so and well, that's that. Then. We are we leaving the spot down next to the red belts for the next level of belts? Uh, yes, yeah, I was going to put blue ones in next to that. Yeah, makes sense. And just happen to be all there. Makes sense. Thinking of it, let's. So I've got. Uh, where where? So I, I think I'll clear a bit up here and do the engine units up here. We're making a little bit of plastic. You just made from. So that's really easy. This Ooh. is where we make so to make uh, I should maybe tell this train uh, where is it? Uh, to have a weight condition. Huh. Is, it, is it driving in? Yeah. Driving off? Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, uh, oh, no, no, no. Stop. Stop. Actually, first of all, Matt, we want to go and get more steel. Oh, wait. Do we have any? Uh, full cargo. Uh, or. Activity five seconds. Okay, wrong train. Wrong train. Let's find the right one. 
Um, there we are. Uh, time passed 30 seconds. Time passed 30 seconds. There's so many roundabouts. <laughs> <laughs> love it. I love it. It's great. I just yoink all your steel. So here might be a good spot. Let's make engine units over there. Unless, are there an insane amount of trees here? Uh, yes, there are, and we're not making grenades. So, yeah. I could actually set up grenade production. Because we need that for science as well. Oh, it's down south. That's okay. I do need to get a uh, rover port down there at some point. Mm -hmm. But it has been dealt with. Good, good. So. Uh, I'm I'm at a confusing uh, a dilemma. Okay. The What's crossings, that? the rail, the, the rail system we have, where yeah. you know every so often they have a crossing on the. Uh, <coughs> yeah. That was causing trains to slow down because mm -hmm. every time a train crosses the top rail, the bottom rail goes red, and it causes it to slow down. Okay. Taking them out means you just get really long straight tracks with no signals on. Because if you put signals on, a train will get stuck behind the double one. Yeah. Uh, which means if there's two trains traveling down there, the third train will stop at the roundabout. Mm-hmm. So it's as if it doesn't matter really what I do. It's all just... Yeah. It's, it's, a, it's, it's, it's one evil versus another evil. Which one is the lesser? I I, I think I'm going to go with the the crossing because it's the safer option. Yeah, I, I think so too. Because uh, if something goes wrong, at least then you know only one crossing gets blocked. Yeah. Unless a train runs out of fuel at a crossing, causes sorts of issues. But and the only way I can make the crossings more compatible so that one line doesn't stop the other one is if we widen the tracks even further mm -hmm. which won't work because we don't have space for that <laughs> <laughs> uh, my round. 64 let's make 64 of these okay I probably need some more steel, yeah. Is the ramp clear? Uh, um, what I'd like to do, mm -hmm. uh, you see where I'm going with this rail? Mm -hmm. um, I'd like to go out a bit further and then turn it north and uh, go over the water and connect up to where your um, green circuit pick up. Yeah. You know the junction there? Turn that into a roundabout and run the rail straight down. Yeah. We'll go, we'd have to kink around the copper. But... Yeah, but that's okay. Then, and it gives us another option for trains to go that way instead. Yeah, yeah. I think that's a good idea. So, yeah, I'm gonna hit the... if you look where I am now, but uh, yep, I was thinking of turning this into uh, our mall.
Yep. I, I I will be very interested to see how you figure out <laughs> getting the trains in, because I'm. Oh, that's not a problem. Need parking. Yeah. Uh, we don't need parking at the mall, do we? No, I suppose <clears throat> if you set the trains to um. Well, what happens when the mall fills up? What, what the train's going to do once it fills up? They're going to go back to uh, to their pickups. Uh, yeah, yeah, because it would just be a, a standard drop off, wouldn't it? It would be a yeah, yeah. So it'd be shared with the other stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. That one. Yeah, except. Let's turn all this out. And find our T junction blueprint. Can I insert wood our inventory tool? Not again. Piece of wooden down. Do we, do we have passive provider chest? Some, not a lot. Damn it. Electric circuits for that. That's not, shouldn't be too bad. Why don't you have power? Power is good. You should have power. Oh, uh, is it built just outside? I think it was. No? Why is there no power here? That is so weird. What the heck? Die. Oh, I'm on rails. Risk. You have power. You have power. You have power again now. Okay. Good. Was it just that range of a power pole or something? Yeah. Well, well no. Actually, it was, um, uh, weird. I, I, I don't know what, uh, what it was doing, to be honest. Fair enough. <laughs> Need some rails. Yep, I'm using an awful lot of rails. I really wish robots. You wish, you really wish robots what? Faster. Yeah. Robots were fast. That would be very nice. Yeah, 
actually, you know what? Ah, stop it. I have a plan. I have a plan. Make that, make that crossroads. Crossroads. Cross, cross roundabout. Build the uh, plastic here. Maybe battery below it or something. Something. I don't know. I say plan. I have a rough idea. That's almost the same. Yeah. That in. And we'll definitely need a few different stops. So if we do well actually let's make a stop here. Exactly one stop. Can I make more? No, I cannot. I need everything. Okay. Fine. Everything. Yeah, pretty much. And then we need one, three, four, five, six, seven, nine. Outputs. Okay, so, um, the bell tolls once again. Oh, really? And uh, yeah, really, really. Okay. I don't well, know how that keeps. No, but uh, it does. So we better call it. Indeed. Yeah. Let's do that. Uh, and then next episode, I shall work on plastic. Okay. Progress is slow, but is progressive. True. Okay, so thank you all very much for watching. Uh, we hope you've enjoyed this one, and we hope to see you again in the next one. And until then, as always, have fun. Bye-bye. <laughs>